point that we're coming to, the point of release or realization is to start to come to see that that even the metaphor of right mind and wrong mind, which every good course student <laughs> certainly comes to see that one, you know, that that's a basic thing, that that's a metaphor. That, and Jesus, in metaphorical sense, hints at that in the, the lessons of the Holy Spirit in the text when he says, you know, ultimately there can be no reconciliation or between what is true and what is not true. And that the right mind and the wrong mind are mutually exclusive. It's just a metaphor of taking something that, that two things that are, that are complete opposites and talking about them as if they coexist. It has to be a metaphor. Right? 